What is up everyone and welcome to the Tiki YouTube channel. Today I decided to get into a routine of posting videos as I have not been posting any content on this channel for a year or two. So expect a video in the near future on why I've been posting any content and I did hit 5,000 subscribers long ago and I did not celebrate that milestone with my subscribers. So I want to say thank you as the giveaway will be coming up shortly so stay tuned for that. But until that happens I didn't want to make you guys wait any longer. And this today, I decided to just get into this app review and review an application called Systems Duplicate Finder. Now, this is probably going to be in my top 10 must-have Mac apps because of the way they've designed the application and how quick and intuitive it is. There are a lot of applications that help you find duplicates and save you some memory, but none of them do it this quick and this this nicely, very simply, such as this System Duplicate Finder. But before I show you guys how the app works, let's go into the App Store. Links will be down below. To download this application as well as, as the website the application is $29.99 but you do not have to purchase it because there is a trial version for all the apps that they uh, offer so this is the page system it's a very well-known developer company that makes recovery applications utility PDF and etc so you will not have a problem with trying it out and if you don't like it which I doubt you can you know just delete the application but here it is as I said so $29.99 as I said it's worth every penny and it's something that will help you find your duplicate finders, delete any folders, any apps uh, that you do not need. And it's just a second copy of it. So let me show you guys how the app works. So I'm going to press this plus icon here and I'm going to select the folder for it to delete or that there are multiple copies of. So I'm going to go to my applications and I'm going to select this and press open and I'm going to press scan. So within my After Effects folder, I can see that there's scanning the 700 plus files. It's going to show me the duplicates it found and some of the memory that it can spare me because many of us, including myself, uh, just back up files and then we have some duplicates that we don't really need and it's just taking up space. So this application will do a good job of removing those extra files. So I'm not going to wait for this just for the sake of this video, but press stop. And it's going to show you guys a section as you can see here. So multiple files here. So these are just motion tracking applications, shapes and builds and stuff for the Adobe After Effects. So I'm going to press delete. These are all extras. You can restore files in trash note that select the files on the external drive can be erased permanently. Press OK. It's going to send it straight to trash. And you can see not only that on the bottom, it show you the file selected and the storage space that it frees up documents images etc so it does not only do like just folders it does applications as well archives packages everything and this application is well worth it so as i said link will be down below so if i press x here and go back into the application again you can see that it gives you an option to change the scanning method the removal method and also how much of a similar you want within the images and folders the file size and you can also ignore and block certain types of applications or pictures that you don't want so in case it's sensitive you don't want the application to scan it and accidentally delete it so it's a very useful application link will be down below for all the platforms it's available on it's 29.99 but does have a trial within the app within the website of the developer so uh make sure to check it out Thank you so much for watching and as I said, I do apologize for not posting a video but I will be back and expect a lot of fun videos coming up, giveaways, tutorials, etc. So thank you for watching this video. Make sure to like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one.